How quickly do you react when someone pulls in front of you when you're driving? Or when a ball comes your way in a sporting field? Or when you have a slip and you need to catch yourself before you fall? We all react to these day-to-day -day challenges at different speeds. Some of us react slowly and maybe we think we're accident prone. And some of us react really quickly and perhaps we think we're more of a ninja warrior. How quickly you react to a situation can actually be really important in many, many ways. From helping to prevent accidents on the road through to reaching your optimal potential on the sporting field. How quickly we react to a situation or a stimulus is called our reaction time. And it depends on how fast our brains can sense what's going on around us, then process that information and come up with a reaction plan, and then perform the appropriate response. As you can see from this description, your reaction time depends on how efficiently your brain and nervous system are working. So what can you do to help improve the efficiency of your nervous system? This is a really interesting question that chiropractic researchers have been trying to help answer. The reason that chiropractors are interested in reaction times is that chiropractic aims to improve the communication between your brain and your body, so you are better able to react and respond to your environment. When your brain can accurately perceive what is going on inside and out, it can better control your body for the situation at hand and move your muscles in the right order and the right speed at the right time. Researchers have published a number of studies that have shown that chiropractic care can actually make a difference to your reaction time. One of the first really good studies that looked at how chiropractic care affects reaction times was published back in 2000. In this study, the researchers asked a group of students to look at a computer screen that would flash up the letter R on it. They were asked to hit one key on the keyboard if they thought the letter R was the right way round, or a different key on the keyboard if they thought it was back to front. To make it tricky, the researchers rotated the letter R in lots of different angles. That way, the students being tested had to mentally rotate it back into the original position to determine whether the R was the right way round or not. The researchers then got a chiropractor to either adjust the person or to have them lay down on a chiropractic table without doing an adjustment as a control intervention. What the researchers found was that after an adjustment, the study subjects were able to faster mentally rotate the letter R compared to the control group. It meant that their brains were faster able to assess and respond to this task. This study shows that a chiropractic adjustment can actually affect how quickly our brains respond to sensory information and make sense of them. This is a really interesting finding as it shows that the way our spines work influence the way our brains work. In 2016, another group of researchers published a study that looked at how quickly a group of older adults could take a step on a platform that had four panels that could light up. When a panel lit up, these older adults were supposed to move their foot as fast as possible to stand over the light. Being able to take a fast step is really important because scientists have shown that people who are quicker at taking a step are less likely to fall. In this study, they tested the older people before, during and after receiving 12 weeks of chiropractic care or receiving their usual medical care. What they found was that after 12 weeks of chiropractic care, there was a dramatic and significant improvement in the chiropractic group's step time. They were able to take a faster step after chiropractic care. The improvement seen in the older adult's ability to take a faster step in this study was actually two and a half times greater than what was found in a large clinical trial that looked at the effects of six months of exercise on the same stepping task. This might be really important when it comes to someone stopping themselves from having a fall if they're tripping or slipping. Again, it shows us that the way your spine works actually influences the way your brain can sense what's going on and the way your brain can respond to your environment. The way your spine works helps your brain function better and respond faster. 
In another study that was published recently, researchers tested a group of special operations forces, military personnel, to see whether chiropractic adjustments improved how quickly they could react and touch a set of panels on the wall in front of them that would light up at random. What they found in this study was that when these elite soldiers were adjusted, they were quicker at reacting and responding to the lit up panels than if they were not adjusted. This is a really significant finding because just imagine how important response times would be for a soldier. So you can see that researchers are discovering that chiropractic care really does seem to have an impact on how efficiently your brain can accurately perceive what's going on around you and how fast your brain can react and respond appropriately. So maybe it can help you move from being accident prone to being a ninja warrior. So if you want to get your ninja warrior on, why don't you go get your spine checked by your family chiropractor?